Silver from the Germania Mint. Hello, I'm Silverstruck and welcome to my channel. I've been silver collecting lately. Not so much stacking, but definitely collecting. And I have a, a couple really exciting pickups to uh, share. I got these from Atmax. That's how they come packaged. Uh, picked up a couple of them. And uh, a great series of silver. If you're not familiar with the Germania Mint, they do collector high-end silver. Uh, so not so much for, for stacking, like I was saying. They come very well packaged. Uh, this is the Allegories Italian Germania series. And as you can see, it's a 2-ounce, uh, four nines pure silver. Let's take a look. Inside the package, we have the coin. Thank goodness. <laughs> and then we have uh, a certificate of authenticity. And I'm going to hold this up so you guys can pause the video later and read about this particular coin. It's uh, It's extremely well done. I love the packaging uh, and I absolutely love the coin as well. So let's find out what this coin's about. Okay, so now we're looking at the obverse of uh, the coin and the wording to the top says uh, um, allegories 2 ounce 999.9 fine silver and on the face of the coin we have Lady Germania to the right with her arm outstretched and her hand on Lady Italia. And that's in a symbol of friendship between the two cultures. Uh, right next to Lady Italia on the left hand side, we have the Horn of Plenty, and that symbolizes prosperity and wealth. Great obverse. So let's check out the reverse. All right, so we're in the reverse of this coin now. And as you can see, uh, the top of the coin says Germania, underneath that, the date 2020, and to the bottom of the coin, the denomination 10 mark, which is what makes this different than a round. This is a coin because of that government-backed denomination uh, to the bottom of the coin. In the middle of the coin, we have a coat of arms, and we can talk briefly about the coat of arms. There's more detail that you can get into on the website, but let's start with that upper left-hand symbol and that is a bicephalus eagle, which is a uh, basically a symbol in Roman mythology. The heads are facing opposite directions, uh, and that symbolizes past and future. The symbol to the right of the eagle is a checker pattern, and that refers to prudence and wisdom. To the bottom left, we have the gold ribbon with three flowers, and that represents the determining values. Uh, unity, integrity, and freedom. To the right of the ribbon, we have the wild boar. The wild boar is a symbol of mightiness, and it was extremely popular among uh, the Roman legions. That's why that is on the coin. And of course, the coat of arms is surrounded by a wreath of oak leaves, and that symbolizes loyalty, stability, and national unity. So there you have it. That's the basics about this, this coin. Uh, I love it. I think it's extremely well done. So let's talk about the collectability of this series of coins. I was able to pick up a couple 1-ounce coins and a couple 2-ounce coins. Now, the mintages are what makes these highly collectible along with the, sheer, the actual quality of the coin. So um, let's talk about that. The 1-ounce has a mintage of 25,000 where the two ounce, the mintage drops all the way down to 2,500. Uh, so not many. On top of that, if you were to get the five ounce, the mintage was only 500, and the 10 ounce, the mintage was 250. So along with the symbolism, meaning quality of the coins, uh, we also have very low mintages. And that's what makes these very collectible. And uh, before I go, there is one more piece of German silver I'd like to talk about. I received uh, this letter in the mail. I cannot show you the obverse, just the reverse, because there is personal information on the obverse of the letter. And uh, this is a uh, person in the community that I've become friendly with. He's a great guy. And uh, he wrote me this note. And it says, Hey SS, I appreciate the kind gesture in helping me get a Chiclet Inglehard. Please accept this small token of my appreciation. Take it easy, good sir. Stay safe. Thanks again. 
TDA. And for those of you who don't know who TDA, TDA is, that is The Dude Abides. And he has a very good uh, channel. He's a great guy. And I was happy to help him get that Inglehard Chiclet Bar. In the envelope, he sent me this. Do not throw item inside. As we open it, we have a Geiger bar. And not just any Geiger bar. This is my first 5 gram Geiger bar. Um, dude, thank you so much. You didn't have to do this. Uh, I really do appreciate it. Absolutely love the bar. But more importantly, um, if you're watching this far in the video, uh, you should actually go right now and check out the Dude Abides channel. He has a fantastic channel, and uh, if you like vintage silver, you will not be disappointed. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please consider hitting that like button. Do you collect silver or gold from the Germanium Mint? Let me know in the comments, and thank you so much for watching.